Hello everyone and welcome again to Stu Whippies, the gaming channel, trying to put some fun back into gaming. Uh, I'm not really a Battlefield uh, fan to be honest. I have played, I played uh, Star Wars 1, I played the Copper 1, I'm, I've played a couple before but I, I just couldn't get into them. Just couldn't get into them but I noticed the open beta was out so uh, obviously it being free to have a go on I thought, Do you know what, I'm going to jump online. Uh, download it and I'll have a go. Uh, do you know what? It's all right. I, I've seen things saying it's going to replace Call of Duty. It's not. Call of Duty is a really fast-paced game. Uh, what I mean by that, contacts are really constant and all that sort of stuff. So you're getting flat. Don't get me wrong. You get all that sort of stuff on this, but the maps are just so massive. It's unreal. So they've got the two game types which are conquests which big version of the domination you need to capture flags and all that sort of stuff and there's rush uh, i've actually got rush on at the moment uh, i went on conquest and it's almost the end of a game and so i didn't really <laughs> know what was going on i am struggling with the buttons i must admit uh melee and crate just swap round and i can't swap them around for some reason so every time i try to keep cover I'm melleeing and I'm trying to take shots and I'm firing and I'm melleeing and it's taking me off side like I did there but it's not bad uh, I said I don't mind my sniping and that sort of stuff uh, it is hard to hit him sometimes uh, I don't know if this is meant to be real world physics so you should aim slightly above so I've been messing around trying to get it all done myself uh, all done, you know what I mean, learn yourself, then you know, then you so, but no, I, 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 I do enjoy it, the problem is I come across things like tanks, I get, keep on getting blown up and dying a lot, but that's the game, it's a new game to me, I, I haven't got a clue, well the maps you say, but they're quite big in they, so lots of cover and that sort of stuff, uh, you've also got your different classes, there was this one, which is obviously a, like a sniping class, there's uh, like a recon, like assault where you get like an automatic pistol oh i'm meant to do against a tank <laughs> fucking piece of shit man i'll tell you what i was getting slaughtered by them but this is what happens you get come back draw back out the map and you can pick new sections where you want to go to so anywhere you control you can go and control so uh but i thought i'll try the plane oh i thought awesome my granddad well my great granddad my nan's dad was a was a pilot in World War One, so this is quite mad. This is for you. <laughs> straight death, straight away. <laughs> I couldn't even, couldn't even fly the piece of shit. So, but that's obviously something I'm going to have to look into and uh, and try. Uh, yeah, vehicles you can fly around in. Uh, obviously, you saw the tank that blew me up. Uh, me and uh, another person, he jumped into it driving. I, so I thought, right, I'll just jump in the back and try and shoot what I can. Which is alright, actually. It wasn't too bad. Look, I see why people like this game. And I can see why... This, see it? Blown up again by a fucking tank. Tanks are really annoying in this game. So, uh... <laughs> but yeah, I can see the fun. I can see the fun. I said, uh... The different classes. The medic one. The rifle weren't too bad. But every time I went to try to help someone, I got killed by, by people. So... And yeah, I just went back to trying to snipe people, especially in these type of games where there's lots of range and that sort of stuff. So, uh, yeah, yeah. The only thing I'd say, it's 7 gig. So if you've got 500 gig hard drive, just watch it. Especially if you... It's probably not... I don't know. If you enjoy this type of game, it's probably worth getting rid of stuff to do it. But if, if you've never really liked the Battle, Battlefield series themselves... Uh, if you've got the room, do it, but if you're going to get rid of something you like for it, it's probably not worth doing it, to be honest. Uh, I am going to put some more time in, because I would like to get up the habit of trying to melee everything instead of fucking trying to uh, crouch and that sort of stuff. But, I've been trained, and I've done battle simulations, and I've done all that sort of stuff, and I'll tell you what, it's probably as close as you're going to get to being on a battlefield, generally. Because oh, I obviously Call of Duty is nothing like that. You know what I mean? But, uh, yeah, for bullets flying over your head, random people flanking you, you know what I mean? Got to aim properly and that sort of stuff. So, yeah. No, give it a go, people. Give it a go. It's free. 
I said uh, the Call of Duty one last year, you had to have the bloody uh, what was it, the fucking pre-order. I still couldn't get it for some reason because I didn't pre-order it online. But like I said before, if you pre-order something online and you download it on your computer, well, that's it. You're fucked. You can't take it back if you don't like it. So, but yeah, yeah, uh, only a couple of minutes more worth of gameplay of that. So what I'm going to let you do, I'll let you have a look at the gameplay, get a feeling for the sound and all that sort of stuff. And what I'll do once. I'll put a few more hours in. I'll, I'll make another video giving a bit of a better review. See if it's worth buying when it comes out next month, is it? So, yeah, everyone, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you later.